Welcome to my man cave at the house. Welcome to my home garage. I don't think we've ever shot a video at my home garage. As you can see, it's all white and it's all Rolls Royces. I love white and a lot of people ask me, why do you have so many Rolls Royces? Well, they're all different. This one here, for example, is a ghost and is a family car. We don't mind getting the kids in there, making it dirty. It also has the highest mileage. We've used it more than any other uh, Rolls Royces, but it's black interior and it's pretty cool. It's got the starlight ceiling. And then this over here is a new Dawn 2021. I love this car because it's fast, smooth, and it's got Bluetooth. But more than anything, it's white on white, super white. It's called, I think, Arctic White. And uh, on Mondays when I'm super busy and I get a lot of phone calls, I take this puppy to work. This is a 2016 drop head. 2017 was the last year they made it. I love drop head. I think it's just elegant. It's a big boy toy. It's much bigger than the Dawn and uh, exclusive. They don't make it anymore. And as a matter of fact, I bought the first drop head in 2008. So many people offer me to buy this car, but it's like your first love. You don't want to let go. And this has a lot of miles. I think I've driven 51,000 miles on this car. And the difference between the two is obviously the grill. On this one, the grill wraps around the hood. On that one, they made the grill a little bit smaller. But the only thing I don't like about this one, doesn't have Bluetooth. And it's a little bit slow. It's got a lot of uh, mileage on it. But I still like to take it once in a while out for a cigar and when I want to just reminisce and go back in time. I have a lot of memories with this car. What is your favorite memory you have with this car? Oh, my favorite memory? Are you kidding me? I got married in this car. Me and Leila got married in 2011 and we used this car. We had it all decked out and a lot of pictures. Speaking of Leila, this is her newest ghost and she opted for this crystal spirit of ecstasy that lets up when the car is uh, on gorgeous this one the kids are not allowed and it's all white on white gorgeous but all the bells and whistles i think it's a little too white but too late now but this is gorgeous much bigger you can just see the car seems to be longer i love how they really designed the end it's kind of like a stretch and looks, looks bigger and beefier and Definitely noticeable versus the old Ghost, which was a little bit more boxy. Well, owning five Rolls Royce does come with a problem. Once in a while, I'm dressed up. I'm out here in the morning and I just can't figure out which one to take to the office. So that's a little bit of a problem, but it's a good problem to have. But my favorite, if I have to pick one out of all of them, would have to be the drop head. This new drop head really is super rare. You don't see too many of these, but you see a lot of Dawn, a lot of Ghost, but I say a lot, you know, more often than a drop head. But yeah, it's gorgeous. And did I tell you guys I have 10 umbrellas? Each car comes with two umbrella. So I can retire on these umbrellas. Are these all the Rolls Royces? Like, are you, you sold one, right? Uh, no. What did I sell? What do you mean? They oh, they calling them. Oh, not even that. They huh. extended wheelbase. Oh, yeah. <laughs> See, I had so many Roy's Red, I forgot. <laughs> so I sold my extended wheelbase because it was black. And it was getting a little bit old. So I'm looking for a white extended wheelbase, Phantom Series 8, to add. And also, we had the Cullinan. We sold it. We had it for a couple of weeks. 
you know, it was more for Layla and she thought it was too big, bulky and wasn't comfortable, you know, in the parking spaces and especially parking it here. So we got rid of that. But um, excited for the Series 8. Phantom Series 8 is one that's missing from the lineup that I'm gonna be adding soon. So watch out for that video. Oh, my thoughts on the boat tail. It's a lot of money, $28 million. Yeah, they only made three, but um, I'm a little bit divided on the design. I don't know, I think they could have done a little bit better with the rear of the car. I love the front. It's pretty much this, more refined. Um, but the rear of it, I don't know, it's more of a boat. That's why it's called boat tail. But pretty cool for those lucky three owners. But I ain't gonna put that much money off for a Rolls Royce as much as I love them. All right, guys, I just got done turning all of them on to check out the different headlights. So cool. And hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe, like the video. Be safe, be well. See you guys next week. Residential investors work longer hours for lower returns compared to commercial real estate investors. Contrarian Academy helps residential investors successfully acquire their first commercial property in six months or less. There's a lot of pockets of opportunity where you can take great real estate that's located in a great location and repurpose it. While one state for example, Houston that's heavily invested in oil and gas industry is experiencing a recession. You may have another state like California experiencing the economic boom. You don't really have to wait for a global economic recession to jump out and invest your money and buy real estate. Apply now by clicking the link below.